A girl is traveling through an intersection with a green light, but the car traveling in the other direction decides to make a left-hand turn in front of the girl. The girl slams on her brakes as hard as she could, but she cannot stop, and the car's T-bone. During the crash, the girl's knee hits the bottom of the dashboard. She jams her ankle against the brake, and she feels something give way in her foot. She has immediate pain. She's taken to the hospital and diagnosed with a Liz Frank injury. Hang on for a moment, and I'll explain what you need to know about a Liz Frank injury. Hi, I'm Dr. Guy DiMartino, a Northwest Indiana injury and accident lawyer and author of A Guide to Indiana Car Accident Claims. A Liz Frank injury is a fractured dislocation of one or more bones in the midfoot. The injury has a common mechanism. Aside from the above story, I have also had folks who did this by stepping into a hole and twisting the foot or getting their foot caught in the foot peg in a motorcycle accident. The injury can be quite debilitating if it is not timely diagnosed and treated. And even with the most timely care, these folks a lot of times do not recover well. And the reason for that is the midfoot is very important in maintaining the arch. Treatment for this injury can range from simple casting and immobilization to open reduction internal fixation surgery. The type of treatment will depend upon the severity of the fracture and the degree of the dislocation. Over the years, I've had fits and fights with insurance adjusters about compensation for my clients with these claims. Insurance adjusters take the position that these claims are just fractures and they should heal. However, these fractures do not heal because the problem is the dislocation. You see, ligaments hold bone to bone and keep the integrity of any joint. When you have a dislocation, you injure that ligament and that can cause chronic dysfunction in the foot and pain and suffering because the foot loses its stability. I have two recommendations regarding these accidents. Number one, be sure to get timely diagnosed and treated and follow your doctor's recommendations to a T. And number two, you will need a strong advocate to deal with the insurance company. Be sure the attorney that you retain understands the nature and extent of Liz Frank injuries because if you are somebody who works on your feet all the time, these injuries can impact the rest of your life. If you would like to request a free copy of my book, click the link. I am Guy DiMartino, meeting you at the intersection of law and medicine. Have yourself a great day.